is Zan from Mother Rucker here. Today I'm going to show you how to use an Ergo Baby Omni 360 and an Ergo Baby Embrace Carrier to carry two children. First thing we're going to do is pop the Ergo Baby Embrace on around your torso. This is going to be the carrier you're going to put your younger child in. Your older child must be able to sit unaided and they will be going in the 360 on your back. What we're going to do now is we're going to do up the straps on the Ergo Baby Embrace and we're going to do them really, really loose, okay? This is because once we've got a child on our back, we won't be able to cross the straps because we'll have a child in the way. So we do the straps up first, but you're going to leave them really, really long, okay? Like so. Make sure you bring all that slack forwards to the bottom of the carrier. This will make it a lot easier to put your child in once your other child is already on your back. Now take your Ergo Baby Omni 360 carrier and ensure that the base is the correct width for your older child. I'm going to be using a two year old demo doll, so it needs to be on the widest setting. Bring the carrier up round your waist and clip it in behind you. I prefer to hip scoop my child onto my back, so my carrier is going to be on my hip. If you prefer using another method, by all means, use that method. First thing I need to do is check my straps. I need to check that my side strap is nice and long, and then I need to check my front strap is short. There we go. Now I'm ready for my child. So I bring my toddler up onto my side, onto my hip, and I bring the carrier up over her back. Now, because she's at a growth spurt, I also need to adjust the top panel of my carrier and rebutton it to extend the length so that I'm still up to her neck. This is really important to do once your child gets bigger. This stops them being able to fall out the top of your carrier when they're leaning. I'm then gonna bring the straps over her shoulders, hold them both in one hand, and I'm gonna thread my back hand along her tummy through the short strap and under her bum. I'm then gonna swing her round onto my back, like so, and take the long strap from the neck to my neck and pass it behind my head to the other shoulder. I then hold the tension on top and slip my arm through that long strap, grabbing the webbing and pulling it down and up to tighten. I'm then going to do my chest clip to secure those straps on my shoulders. Now I'm ready to put my younger child in my Ergo Baby Embrace Carrier on my front. I'm now just making sure that all the slack is off my back at the front, ready for my child to go in. So I'm gonna pick up that baby, pop them on my shoulder, and I'm gonna go in through the leg hole to catch the first leg. This is a lot easier than trying to guide their legs through from the top, especially if they're not in the most cooperative mood. So we come all the way up, catch the foot and bring that through. Then I pull the carrier up to their neck, like so. Get them in position. Make sure their arms are up. And then pull the slack round my back and then tighten my strap. Okay, watch out for little fingers there. And I'm gonna do the same on the other side. I'm gonna pull the slack round my back and then tighten my strap. I now need to sort out my baby's seat. They're not quite there in the carrier. And there we go. A sibling carry with an Ergo Baby Omni 360 on the back and an Ergo Baby Embrace carrier on the front. Thanks for watching, bye.